just a milk bar for yes. breakfast. It's kind of a little more. It's not like a traditional one. A lot of foreigners having breakfast here. I mean, again, it's not too far from the square, yeah. so that's expected. And the uh, menu, like the breakfast menu, is very much international breakfast. Menu. Very European, yeah. You have the Irish breakfast, you have the English breakfast, you have the hot stuff. Poach eggs and, yeah. and so on. So, yeah, when it comes, let me show you what it's all about. Hopefully, it's delicious. With apple and cinnamon. That's a dessert. For you. Mm -hmm. You two are having dessert for breakfast. Two. <laughs> two of a kind. No, that's her second dessert because she had oh. the, the sweet bun. <laughs> It's okay, we need all the energy. We're gonna be walking a lot. <laughs> mm, that looks like uh, sauerkraut. <laughs> So we just got off that breakfast place. It was good. It, it, it wasn't anything amazing. My poached eggs. Yeah, poached eggs. Yeah, my crepes were good. Back to the main square. We're probably gonna visit St. Mary's Basilica. Oh, Mary's Basilica. Tutaj podobno to okno. Hey, 
Nie. 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 So the last time we went inside the castle, so you see a lot of armors and paintings. paintings. I don't remember, honestly. <laughs> well, there's also like their artifacts, yeah. uh, the rooms, the different yeah. rooms they have. Furniture and things. Furn yeah. The and, standard. And this time the cathedral went up there. Well, um, mom, that says, nice. mom says that last time when we came here, there was a huge lineup to get into the cathedral. That's uh, why okay. we didn't go. go? Okay. Because it was the weekend, mm -hmm. that's the, like the worst timing to, to go. Yeah. We Enjoy. actually have a full day to spend. Yeah. Are we going that way? Uh, we that's kind of outside. Or do we want to walk that way? Or go that way and see what's there? <laughs>
stuff to buy. It's like the market when we went to the restaurant, they had these two things. Oh, yeah. uh, you don't want the children to know that literally. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Ten times to that price. Well, it's 100 grams though. How much is the gram? HPLM 400 grams. Uh, so, how, how much it's gonna be, whatever. Finish prepping for fish. Mm -hmm. Bones all out. Mm -hmm. now, left that way. Mine? I'll just, I'll just wait for it. Have you even taken a bite? Yes, I have. And how is it? Good. Want to try? Sure. Yeah. So is it called again? Obvashane. So it's the, I don't know if it's the origin of uh, bagel, but it's pretty much like bagel. Or some people say it's like soft pretzel, so I don't know. Uh, yeah, I think soft pretzel is a good description of it. I think it's a, the, the inside of it is, a, is similar in texture, but I think that the skin of it is, this one is tougher than the Montreal bagel. That's right. No. Hundred percent bagel. Montreal so there's bagel. Montreal bagel, there's New York bagel, mm -hmm. and I would that say one. that this is Krakow bagel. Yeah. Sure. More than anything else, it's sure. very bagel-like, more than soft pretzel. I don't know how to eat it with something else on top of it, but I think we eat it um, just like this. If anything, I would cut it in like smaller pieces yeah. and yeah. use it to pick up things like. Uh, dips or something it is salty though mm -hmm. but it also s tastes um sweetness mm. so with somebody else <coughs> that the way you eat it it's just like this so try to bite it just like that it is tougher this way yeah you can absolutely you can tear it into pieces but that's that's what i mean that you can tear in pieces and like dipping it in into something like the cream cheeses or something could be the origin of montreal new york bagel
So in this little garden, it's kind of like a cafe, right? With beer. Mm -hmm. Beer, teas, coffees. We went here, see what I can get. There is a fresh fruit juice. Mm -hmm. So smoothies. Uh, so it's strawberry and banana today, so that sounds good. Hot and cold drinks. Mm -hmm. yeah. And Kate, instead of beer. taking the bubble tea, for the main reason we're here, no, nope, she got the same thing. Yes, she did. Yeah. It's a nice place, then a regular cafe if you want to work. I see someone back there using their laptop. If you want to work outside, I guess it would be a nice place to do. Other than indoor, inside a cafe. It, it seems like this um, passage has some kind of histor historic uh, meaning because I see a touring group back there. Mm. Yeah. yeah, there's the downside of us winging it just by walking around. We have to Google it, see what's going on, if anything interests us, otherwise we won't know what's going on. Maybe we should start looking up for walking tours here and there, just, you know, try to understand the area a little bit more. We just want to walk around and see what's in the area, how it feels. Like we walk a little bit over on the south side of it, it's not as touristy, people are getting off work. There's a quieter uh, across the bridge. Uh, Kid actually like that place. Uh, I would call that place a little bit hipsterish. I mean, it is next to an art uh, gallery. The buildings, like the residential buildings, are newer and like on the ground floor, facing the street. You have all those little shops and uh, service places, like uh, optician, hairdresser, nail salon, and things like that. And yeah. the little clothing stores and things like that. And once we cross back to the bridge, it is much busier. Tram everywhere, people moving around, uh, normal area. And then we turn a little bit back into the Jewish quarter and that's where we end up. So it's not too far. <laughs> now, walk a little bit more, let's just relax a bit. We have more to walk in the next couple of days. So. Yeah, so after Krakow, we are planning to go to Zakopone, and then from Zakopone, we have Boya, and after Zakopone, just, just to visit my great uncle, and then we're heading home. But yeah, uh, I said it before, I'm going to say it, you can take a lot of pictures, you can take a lot of videos, uh, being up here is just we'll not be replaced. surreal, uh, one must visit this place for sure well unless you're not a mountain kind of person i guess and you don't care about the beauty of the nature then, then there's yeah. something wrong with you <laughs>